Γεια σας. Let's wait for a few more minutes for more people to come. Okay, I think we can start. So, Yasas, Kalimera, thank you for taking the time to be here today. This is the first live session of the series Greek from Scratch. Uh, it's a review of the first four classes. Uh, later on, I will have two special guests here who will help out with the games. So, stick around. Okay, let's start by introducing ourselves. My name is Stalo, Melene Stalo. If you wouldn't mind, um, let's just go around. You can write your name and the country you are watching from. Thank you. I see Greek girl. Hello, Greek girl. George, my name is George. Hi, George. And George says he's from Ohio. Hi, George from Ohio. Anyone else? I see a person with a very long name. I cannot read it, but if you can. Okay, Gio says, I'm Gio from the USA. Hi, Gio. Maybe the person with a very long name can um, tell us maybe a shorter name that we can call you by. Okay, I think we can start our review and as people come, we can say hi to them and they can introduce themselves. All right, so in the first four classes, we learned the following.
Number one, we learned all the vowels. Alpha. Epsilon. Eta. Yota. Ypsilon. Omicron. And, and omega. So these are seven vowels. Okay. And we also learned uh, two vowel combinations. Remember we said that in Greek, some letters are pronounced together as one sound. And we learned two of these. One is alpha, yoda, uppercase, lowercase. Alpha, yoda is pronounced e. It makes exactly the same sound as epsilon. So epsilon and alpha, yoda both sound the same, E. They both sound, make the sound E. Eta, Yota, and Ypsilon sound the same as the other vowel combination, which is Epsilon, Yota, or lowercase, Epsilon, Yota. So all these, sound the same, E. So, Eta, Yota, Ypsilon, and Epsilon, Yota, all make the same, the exact same sound, E. And Omicron and Omega make the same sound exactly, O. Number two, before I continue, of course, when I'm done with the review, if you have any questions, you can, we, we will go back and, and you can ask your questions. Any questions you may have on anything I say right now, you can ask me in a few minutes. Okay, so number two, we learned some of the consonants. We learned lambda. Mi, lambda, mi, ni, zeta, uppercase and lowercase, and xi, uppercase, lowercase, and these are, they don't present any problem as far as pronunciation goes. Lambda sounds like L, L. Mi sounds like M. Ni sounds like N. Z, zeta sounds like Z. And xi sounds like X. Next, we learned some more consonants. Kappa. B. We learned Kappa, B, and Taf. All these have a common difficulty, I would say, for English speakers uh, mostly. Um, they are pronounced much softer than the equivalent English letters. So kappa is pronounced, sounds like K, but it's much softer. The same with B is pronounced like P, but much softer. 
And tough is pronounced like T, but much softer. So that's the key word here. All these letters, the three of them, are pronounced much softer than the, than the equivalent English letters. So these are softer. Okay, and the last two consonants we talked about are theta, theta, and uh, he. Theta and he. Theta sounds like th in thick. So it's like, it's like the th in thick. And he sounds like h. Okay, the third thing we learned is the accent. The accent. The accent is the little mark that we put over a vowel in order to know uh, which syllable should be stressed. For example, We have the word Ella. Ella. The accent, this is the accent, this little mark here is the accent that is over the epsilon, which means that we have to stress the first syllable, the epsilon. So it's Ella. Ella. Otherwise, we would pronounce it. Ella, but that's wrong, right? It has to be Ella. That's why the accent is on the epsilon and not on the alpha. Okay, finally, we formed um, syllables and little words with the letters that we learned. Some examples. Mama or uh, Milo. Mama is mom, mommy. Milo is apple. Um, Mazi. Mazi means together. Pano, pano means up. Cato means down. Uh, let's see what else. We learned the word ena. Exo. Ena means one, and exo means out or outside. We also learned some very useful words and expressions. One is, well, one is Ella. Ella, which means come. The other is Pame. Pame, which means let's go. T means what? You can use it in a casual way when you want to, uh, to ask someone to repeat what he or she said. Let's see, I think I see some more people here. Lelos Monty says hello. Hi, Lelos. 
Uh, let's see. Does everyone here know the Greek alphabet? I learned it in one night. That's good for you. Let's see, I, I cannot pronounce your name. That's the person with the long name. That's great. Okay. Uh, and we learned a very useful expression. Melene. Melene. It means my name is. Okay, now apart from this, we learned also three very important verbs. Very, very important. One is Ime. Ime. The second one is Echo. Echo. And the third one is fellow. Now, in English, when we identify a verb, when we list a verb, we always use the infinitive, the to form. So we would say that ime is a verb to be. Or we have another verb, to play, to go. We always use the infinitive to list a verb, in order to list a verb. On the, in Greek, on the other hand, we use always the first person singular, the I form. So, ime means I am. That's how we list the verbs in Greek. We use the first person singular, the I, I form. So, I am. Echo, I have. Thelo, I want, but if we want to say what verb ime is in English, we would say ime is the verb to be, or echo is the verb to have, thelo is the verb to want. But you know that when you see the verb listed in Greek, it's the first person singular, I am. I have, I want. Okay, that's all we covered uh, so far. Um, I want to go back to these two letters, theta and he. Uh, another a student of mine, a fellow student of Greek, of yours, uh, asked me a question some time ago regarding these two letters and I want to address this question. I don't see him here, so probably he, he couldn't attend. Okay, I will answer, he may see it on the replay. So I'm going to delete some of these, I'm going to erase rather some of these so that I can write. So we have Theta and he. Okay, Vies Gav, Vies Gav, that's the student's name. Am I pronouncing it correctly? I hope so. Okay, so Theta and he. Uh, Vies Gav is asking whether Theta, specifically these two syllables, Fe and he. He mentions that fe sounds harder than he. And he's asking whether he, whether the Greek H, the he letter, is softer than the English H. The quick answer is no. And I will explain. Theta is a dental consonant. So theta is a dental consonant. Meaning that it's produced 
by the tongue on the teeth. Theta, th. And he is a palatal. He is a palatal consonant, meaning that it's produced by the tongue on the palate, on the roof of your mouth. So, he. Now, by nature, dental consonants are harder than the palatal consonants. And in addition to this, the palatal consonants can have a different sound depending on what what um, vowel or I should say what sound follows. So if we have, if, if theta, or let's take he. So he is a palatal consonant, right? So if he is followed by epsilon, e, the e sound, or the E sound can be yota, or it can be, of course, any of these. All these make the same sound, E. So if it's followed by an E sound or an E sound, then it sounds softer. The palatal consonant, He, sounds softer than with other, with other vowels. So He or He, sounds softer than ho or ha or hu. And the same thing, similar thing happens in English. Ho as in ho 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 or hi, ha as in ha 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 sounds harder than he, he said or he, he. Does that answer your question, Biesga? If you have any more questions or if anyone has any questions, please let me know. Uh, okay, let me see. I have, I have a couple of questions here. Well, first of all, Naida, good evening. Hi, Naida. Thank you for coming. Okay, let's see. Can um, the person with the long name is asking, can you put the I with those two dots? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Let me see. It even comes with the accent line, which I don't know how to pronounce at all. Uh, I don't think I understand the question. If you can repeat it, um, what, what two dots, what I are you talking about? If you can repeat the question, I can answer. Okay, Vyesgav is here. My question is how it is to have or not. That is a question, to want or not to want. That is a question, to be or not to be. That is a question. I think, well, Christina, hi, Christina. I think these are the dots he means. Oh, I see, I see, I see, okay. Okay, that you're talking about the diaresis, the dots over the eye, right? Let me, so let me read the que your question. Uh, I don't understand. You're asking how to say to have or not to have, to want or not to want, to be or not to be. Okay, I can answer that uh, maybe because it's beyond the scope of this class, I can answer that in, um, in another comment. Uh, okay, let's see. Like in Ptolemai, that they sit in the, the stress accent, put over the eye. Okay, so, sorry, I'm trying to understand here. It comes with the accent. Okay. Um, I think the question you're asking about the alpha, 
when we have an eye with the diaresis, the two dots, even though this is, again, beyond the scope of this lesson. This lesson is, this review is for the Greek from scratch series, which is basically, this is what we learned. But uh, you are asking, I guess, how to pronounce, uh, to pronounce the diaresis. You just separate the, the two sounds. So instead of saying E for the alpha yota, you pronounce it I. It's, there's, they are pronounced like two separate vowels. George, maybe refer to them, to the lesson that you already published. Yeah, maybe, yeah, I can do that. Um, I don't have it handy right now, but there was a lesson where I talked about the diaresis. So if you look for it in my videos, uh, you will find it. It's the, um, I don't remember the exact title. It's the diaresis or uh, the alitica in Greek. Okay. Do you have any other questions on within the scope of this series, which is pretty elementary. It's still the beginning. It's only the first four classes. Any other questions, anyone? Uh, let's see. Why is the he not written like that? I always saw it with only three lines. Are you talking about the xi? Okay. Yeah. Okay, the xi. You're talking about the three lines. I'm going to delete these things. I'm going to erase them because you can see them on the replay. It's nothing that needs to stay here. So you're asking about the xi. You always see xi as three lines and I wrote it like this, right? Okay, this is kind of the, the keyboard xi in, in real life. People usually just write it like this. I mean, I'm sure some people can still write it like this. It's just, I think, not as common. I think mostly people write it like this. Yeah, George is saying about, it's called Diaresis, the video published about two months ago. Thank you, George. Okay, and the gamma is written with that little curve beneath it. That's right. Well, the gamma, we haven't learned the gamma yet. Uh, it's a little bit ahead of this class, the gamma. And this is the lowercase gamma but we will learn that in one of the following lessons, classes, I would say. So this is not part of this class, the gamma. Any other questions? If you have any questions, now is the time to ask because in a little bit, we are going to play some games. When are the games starting? <laughs> Very soon, as soon as I'm sure that there are no other questions. Okay. Okay, I guess we can start the games. And I will have my two special guests. I will have two special guests joining us for the games. <laughs> yes, sis, Emma Lily. Yes, Melene. Yes, yes, Melene Alex. Okay, so we have Lily and Alex. Okay, this is yours. Okay, the first, Lily and Alex are 
learning Greek, just like you guys. Mm -hmm. And first we are going to play hangman in Greek. In Greek, the word we use for this game is kremala. Kremala. This is what we call hangman. The word kremala in Greek means gallows. Okay. okay. So we're going to do it this way. First, Lily is going to give us a word and you are going to try and guess it. And then Alex is going to give us a word and you will try to guess his word. And after that, you will get a turn if you want to give us a word. Okay, okay let's go. Okay. What to do the... All right. Okay. So you want to tell us yes. something? So you guys can start guessing some letters. And if you guys get them wrong, I'll write them up here. And then I'll draw more up to the man. And if I finish the man before you guys guess the word, then I guess I win. Because you guys didn't guess it. <laughs> okay. So, let's so you can start calling out names. So Greek girl says lambda. This one. Is there a lambda? No, there's not. So then I would draw ahead. Right. Is okay, there is no lambda. Okay. I was telling hmm. people okay. are thinking. Let's yeah, see. they are thinking. I always start A. with vowels. A. 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 Okay. Is oh. there an alpha? Yes, there is. You uncovered one letter. So far. all right, there is an alpha. Okay. Nida says. Alpha, yeah, it's the same. So we got yes, that, got yes. That. Christina says Omicron. Oh, there is actually not one. So then I'll draw an I. Right. So there is no lambda. No. There is no Omicron. No. Ah, Vieshav says Vita. I Vita. guess B. So I guess you mean Vita. Yes. Is there a Vita? There is not. No Vita. Let's write it like this. Um, it's okay. it's backwards. Ah, it's okay. It's it's will be okay. Okay, let's see. okay. Let's see now. Um, George says P. P. Yes, there actually is one. All right. You want to see so that people can yes. see the the okay. word. So there is a P and an alpha. Yes. Elliot says. Well, George says P. Okay. Elliot says Ita. No, there is not an... I don't know if you mean age, but um, Elliot, do you mean... Yeah, I don't, I don't know if you mean age, but there is no age either. There is okay. no he, right? So I, yes. There's there is no he, there's no age. Okay, Naida says Ypsilon. Is there an Ypsilon? No, there is not. No Ypsilon? Do you keep forgetting to draw stuff? I know, I know, mm. I am. Okay, Vesgaf says me. 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 Me? Yes, there is one. Okay. Me, great. Guys, try harder. <laughs> okay. Epsilon? Oh, there is one. You guys uncovered the word. It's Bame. Yeah. And that means let's go in Greek, okay, guys? Yeah. Bame, good which job. Which means let's go. Bravo. <laughs> That's good. Great. Good job. And Naita says also Epsilon <laughs> and the person with the long name. I'm sorry. I, I really cannot pronounce your name. I wish okay. I could. It's, yeah. Okay. okay good job, guys. Great. Excellent. Okay. Great job, Lee. Alex. Okay. Alex, 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 we want to switch. Let's switch. Chairs. Switch chairs. Okay, okay. so, uh, hey, that's always short. Yes, it is. Let's delete this, erase this. Oh, okay. I'll have to delete that. But you can delete, you can erase that if you want. Okay, okay, now you go. In the meantime, you can think of words if you want to. Think of letters time. to type of, and then we'll put them on the board and see where it leads us. <laughs> Okay. 
All right, so Alex's word has three, three letters. letters. Let's start. Lello says, well, excellent. Greek girl, nice, cool, excellent. Lello says, says me. Is me. there a me? Yes. Where? Good job, you guys got one letter right. Great, good job, Lelos. N is there. Christina and says alpha. alpha. There, there is, is an, an alpha. alpha. Good job, guys. Yeah. Okay. Uh, there is no, no Omicron. No so one. you can so draw a head. Okay. Naida says Yota. Huh? Alpha with no. Yota is this. There is not. There is no alpha. So alpha Yota. Not so. Wrong. And I. What else? Ah, Anna. the person oh! found it. And Anna. Good job. Good job. <laughs> Good job, guys. Anna, you got it. Wait. Yeah, and what does Anna mean? Um, One. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Good job. Excellent. That's now, really does anyone want to take a turn? Anyone want to think of a word for people to start guessing? Awesome. Let's see. Great. Awesome. Thank you. My okay. little helpers do, are doing a great job. I know. <laughs> if you have a word, guys, type it up. Type how much letters it has and we can start guessing, okay? Does anyone want to go next? If you don't, we are going to play another game. Yes. But it would be nice if you can think, think of, of a word. word. <laughs> Anybody? I don't see anyone being interested. Okay, George says three, three letters. letters. Okay. We're gonna write it up for up here for yeah. you, George. One, two, three. Let's draw the hand. Yeah. There you go. Okay, Alex, if you can sit here on the chair. People can start. Okay, guys, start yeah, so okay, let's see. I have a, a word, but not sure if it's been a. reviewed. Okay. okay, George, can you tell mm. us if it's A or E? Okay, Greek says alpha, Lelo says epsilon. No okay, a, so George there's... says no alpha. So, so let's draw a head. We're drawing the head, and is, is there, there an, an epsilon? E? E? Is there an E? Is George. there an E, George? Alex, what is it? Sorry. E. Who? Echo. Ah. Okay, people. Echo. Yes, for E no, first. It's, wait, it's is not, it's not, there's, ah, echo, okay, yes, let's see. Yes, there is an E. Is it first position? Okay. Thank you, George. Well, Biesgaf said echo. Is it echo? I said it first. What? Epsilon. Ah, okay. Epsilon. Lelo said it. And then. No, echo. Yeah. So yeah. it's not echo, guys. Okay. It's not echo? No, it is not. Okay. So George says it's not echo. echo okay. So keep thinking. So guys. let's see what else. Okay, is there, is a, there a G? G? There you a mean G? you mean a gamma, I guess, right? Yeah. Well, of course, they don't know yeah. gamma yet in this no. series, so probably there is no well ego. Probably there is no gamma, I would think. No, a no okay, no. nope, there is okay. no gamma. You want to make it? Yes, I'll draw okay. three more things. Okay. Mm, lambda? Is there a lambda, lambda? or a C? Is there a lambda or a C, George? No lambda. No lambda. I'm going to start drawing. How about a C? C? So no lambda, so no, not Ella. And George, is there an X C? Is there a C? Yes, for C. Ooh, is okay. it second or Where third is it? position? Um, someone gets and C middle position. Okay. Middle position. So here is C. Wait, C look like and no. Like okay, C easy. Like C. C. It's like uh, uh, okay. 
Xi. <laughs> okay. Xi. Well, okay. yes, for Xi, middle of is, he, is it XE? No, it's not XE. No. So oh. right, maybe. Uh, I'm just gonna go with what he's saying. You guys are running out. The hangman is getting full. Okay, what else? Omicron? Is there I know the last one. Is there an uh, Omicron? Have, no. Oh. Wait. I no. know. I know the letter, so I can tell. Okay. Okay. No Omicron. No. Anyone else have anything else to guess? Okay, wait. Well, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, this is really, this hard. Is really hard. Yeah. It's going it to be is. tricky. <laughs> <laughs> let's see Stop who would that. guess it. Hmm. Okay. You. Is there an Ypsilon? <laughs> Ypsilon. George, can you give us a hint if there's a is there an Ypsilon? No. No, you no Ypsilon. Okay. We only have a few more tries and then the hangman will be finished. Uh oh. I know the last one. I gotta guess. I already know the last one. Okay. There's only one more. Okay. Ooh, high wave. Ooh, yes. Someone said this is wave, right, Alex? So someone said hi to wave. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Baby cute. wave. Yeah. Okay. We okay, let's see. A, A, E, O, U. We have tried every vowel. You you haven't tried all the vowels. There's still Try more. again. There's some more vowels. But it's not a vowel though. Okay. It, uh, I don't know. Probably it's a vowel. But... I know which one it is. Okay, think, right. think, Wait, think. you have to let them guess. Think, think, have to let them guess. Think about it, guys. We still haven't said all the vowels yet. <laughs> okay, Greek girl says... Ita? Ita. Is there an Ita? Is there an Ita, George? No, there's not. I know there's not. No. <laughs> Alex. There's not. <laughs> How do you know? Because I saw it. No Ita. No okay. Ita. Because I saw it. Okay. Okay. Ita. Okay. No, Ita. All you guys have is still oh his God. shoes. That's you guys have his shoes. shoes. That's one more letter, which means one more guess before his shoes are on. Then <laughs> our hangman is complete. <laughs> no, you also have to do his hair. Yeah. I already did his hair. It was. Okay. Your, okay. okay, fine. Two more guesses. Yay. Alex is being okay. lucky. Wait. No, H. No. No, Alex, we're not doing it. Omega, yeah, I think. I don't know if it's right. But I don't know, but was, George. Is it George? Know? Is it Omega? Omega? No, it's not. It's not Omega? Well, let's see. Let's think. George has to. George, George has to. George only knows. I, I know. Okay. That's Omega. George, is it Omega? Is it Omega? Omega. Let's see. Careful, Waiting for you, George. It, yeah. Whenever you're ready, just tell us a bit. Okay. okay, George, is it Omega? Okay, we're waiting. Let's see. Yeah. He said yes. Okay, I guess it's yes, it's Omega. Okay. It is. Want to write it? Yeah. Good yeah. job, guys. Good and job. No. Good Person job. with the long name. That's great. Good job. Good job. Wonderful. Okay. Okay. If anyone else has a word they want to do, go ahead. Okay. Or probably we'll just go to the next, next, game. next game, I guess. Okay. Okay. Now the next game. For the next game, I'm going to give you a set of letters of the ones we already learned in this series mm -hmm. and we're gonna see i will ask you to form words using these letters any of these letters okay so the letters are i will write them at the hands i go first no i do i do Whatever. 
Just the same. Okay. I go for Okay, so we have alpha, epsilon, oh. yota, zeta, careful the one, lambda, mi, and p. So you you can form any words using any of these letters. The a word can have two or more letters. Okay, so let's have let's start with two. Uh, okay. Lily can tell us the okay. first one. Okay. Can you tell us what we're yes. doing? Okay, let's see. How about ma? And that means but, okay? Ma. Right. So one word is ma, which is but me it and is alpha, alpha ma. ma. It means but. Here, Alex. And no, Alex will go word? with another word. And then the rest is yours. Me. With me. Equals with. This is epsilon, Alex, ma. Yeah. It's okay, guys. Okay. We're still learning. So let's okay. make, yeah. Let's still make learning. this epsilon. Alex, ma. This way. E. Make it epsilon. E. Epsilon. Yeah. yeah. Good Great. Job. So, ma means ba and me means we. Great job. Okay. Now, now it's your turn. Let's see what words you can find. Okay. Okay. See that? See that? Okay. We have some words here. Okay. Uh, it I'll might end with L. Yeah, it can end with L. Right. Okay. One word is mazi. Okay. Yes. You know what? Let's make them. Let's. Let's me. Okay. Let's do them by the number of by the number of um, syllables. Okay. Yes. So first we have we have ma and we have me. Me. Now. No. Then we have mazi. Let's write it. Uh, you know, write it here. Okay. Mazi. Shall I write it? Um. Yes, you can Ma write this one, and then I'll write the next. Mazi. Mazi. Means together. Good job. Ella. Right. Yeah. Ella means come. I'll write that. Great. Can I write the next one? Mm, yes. Okay. Pale or Pali. We can say Pali because Pali is kind of uh, dialect. dialect. Like Christina. Pali, you want to write it here? Do, do I write it like that? Yeah, like this. Okay. Pali. Okay. Pali. Pali. Pali means again. Okay. Okay. Pame, -E that's okay. correct. Pame. You want to write that? Mm -hmm. Pame. What else? Okay. You're doing great, guys. Okay, think of some more words. Here are the letters again. Yeah, those are the letters, and we have. I I thought of a few more. Okay, let's let's just wait, though, okay? Okay, okay Pame. I'm sure you can find some more uh, words. Mm -hmm. Can use two or three letters or four. Okay, this is a weird combination in my opinion. Okay, um, but still see. you can you can form some words with this okay. weird combination. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> Christina has one. Okay, Christina says Mila. That's Mila. correct, Mila. Want to write it? Mila. Okay. Mila means it's a it's a command meaning speak, talk. Okay, okay. can we use a letter more than once? No. No. You can use each letter only once. And like mama. No, I'm sorry. You cannot use mama because you cannot use me or alpha. 
Two more times. than one time, right. The word is global but still. The word is glo global but still. I don't know what that means. Lipa. 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 Uh, well, I don't think there is a word Lipa or Lipa, Christina. What does that mean, you think? Lipa or Lipa? Yeah, what's Lipa? I don't know. Yeah, probably it's it's not a word. I am not familiar with this word. I don't think there is a word Lipa or Lipa. Okay, okay Christina, doesn't it mean it misses? Ah, uh, well, that would be Lip. Lippy, to lippy, but uh, yeah, it, we don't have enough letters for I that. I see one from Sorry. George, La. That was one I was Yeah, for La. Sure. Okay. La, La, that's a word. It's a musical yes. note. Yes, La. it is. Do, re, mi, fa, La. so, La. La. Okay. okay. Anything but, else? Pini, well, Pini would be correct. You're right. Yes, but yes. it uses Yota twice, so it it cannot. We cannot use it. Greek girl, mean. Uh, just a second. Mean, uh, no, because mean would be with. Do we have Ita there? We don't have Ita. Ita. This is Ita. And mean would be with Ita. So it's not up there. Z. Uh, again, Anna. we don't have Ita. In Anna I guess word. Anna. Yes. Wait, wait. Anna is correct. Yes, Anna. 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 Okay. Anna, let's see what else. Oops, no, sorry, that's no, okay. I, no. Emma, oh, what is? She, oh, great girl, you meant me, like the musical note. She meant me, not an N. Oh, okay. Ah. Great girl meant me, not me. Ah, I'm sorry. Yes, That's you're musical right. note, just yeah, like yeah, yeah. that. <laughs> yeah, you figured it out. Good job. <laughs> yeah, so great girl meant me, the okay. other, another musical note, not yes. me. Sorry, sorry, great girl. Christina, no. Emma, what is that? Emma, you mean the blood? That would be with alpha yota. So we cannot use it because we cannot use alpha twice. Z, that's Z. correct, George. So Z, you want to write it here? Z, he lives or she lives. That's correct. Yeah. Christina, yeah. Yeah, sorry, Christina, yeah. Emma is with Alpha Yota. Okay. Good job, guys. Yeah. Let's see. Any other words that you guys <laughs> can think of from this? I know there are some more words you can think of. There are some names, if that's yes. That's a hint. Some girls' names come can be formed with these letters up there. Oh, I know one. I know one, guys. <laughs> Pazzi. Okay. Pazzi. What is Pazzi? Pezzi. Pezzi, you mean maybe? Pezzi. It would work, but we cannot use Yota twice. And Pazzi. It's not a it's not a word that I know, Christina. I'm sorry. Can I give one name? Yeah, you can. Please. Yeah, but no. Okay, you want to write? Okay. okay. I thought of um a girl's name that I saw. You could do Liz, which you could use the L. Yeah. I Liz. Okay, right. Liz. So uh, Lily got one. Liz. Liz. That's a girl's Liz. name, okay? There is another girl's name very similar to Liz. Liz. Maybe you can get it. Yes. No, Lelos says Mixa. Mixa. 
Well, mix, I think, is with Ypsilon, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> well, that would be a good one, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone else think of Liz? There is a similar yeah. Greek um, girl's name. It's very similar to Liz. Think about it. Let's see if you can guess it. Can you tell me what it is? Oh, okay. Now I know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, oh, Christina, yeah, Christina got it. Lisa. Yeah, that's good. Oops, I got it right oh, no, it's okay. This is, oh, yeah. The one not right in Greek. Very good, Lisa. Lisa. Good Very job. good. good uh, Naida got it too. Lisa, yes, yeah. Job, Christina guys. and Naida got it. Any other words you can. Think of maybe names, words, words, any other names we're looking back to see. What's the what's the capital of Peru? Capital of Peru. Anyone? Anyone with the capital? You can form it with those letters up there. Think about it for a second. It may take you a second. Yeah, Lima. Christina said Lima. Good That's job. right. That's right. Is it? Yes. Lima. Lima. Lima, capital of Peru. And Lima also means the file when you file your nails. Mm -hmm. Lima is the same word. Okay, guys. Uh, do you give up? Do you guys give up? Okay, we have. Well, how about sheet. I do see two more girls' names? One is Leah. 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 That's a girl's name. Mm -hmm. The other one is mm -hmm. Leah. And I see one more. Yeah, one Leah more. is another girl's name. And then Mia. Mia, right. And Mia is another girl's name, mm -hmm. but it also means uh, one. It's the yes. feminine form of one, Anna. Mm -hmm. Well, there are some more words, but... Uh, yeah, probably you don't, uh, the people who are uh, taking this series, we haven't learned these words yet in mm -hmm. this series. One is Meli. That's a good word to know. It means honey, honey, Meli. Another word is Elia. means olive or olive tree and it also means mole a mole on your skin okay lelo says liza that's good guess lelos the only thing is that we cannot use alpha twice but that's a great word yes mm -hmm. liza okay i guess that's all do you have any and two, yeah, that's right. Yeah, two alpha. Any other questions on anything? No, no questions. Okay, I guess we can say uh, Meza Lima. Yes, we did say Lima. Meza, what is Meza, Naida? Maybe you mean Mesa. Okay, we cannot use Mesa because, because we haven't, um, well, actually, we learned all the letters, but there is no word Mesa that I can think of. Okay. Okay. 
Well, thank you very much for coming. I appreciate it very much. Uh, I, uh, Christina says maybe Naida means Mezedes. Is that what you mean, uh, Naida? Meze, maybe? Meze, Mezedes. Yeah, it would be great, a great word, but we cannot use epsilon twice. Well, thank you all for coming. I really appreciate it. And I hope to see you again soon. Haristo. Yes, us. Bye. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Bye. Bye bye. Thanks for coming.